Resuming part two. That looks further. Yeah. We're putting together the two phases and then turn to the throw on the glide technique. Turn. Yeah, there you go. Does it go up? Yeah, it went up more. Okay, so there's your shot put uh, drill to do. Now we're going to move on to the weighted throw drills. Once again, we're practicing this in phases. For the next couple weeks, you're going to practice holding a way to throw, and you're going to do the release part. So you're going to practice going back, taking it back, and then releasing. Back, releasing. Just switching your feet, releasing. So back, release. That just was a national record. That's my fishing story. It did go far. You're not trying to break a record yet. You're just trying to get the 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 feeling of the release going and and and, and just getting footwork. relaxed in your footwork. Turn, turn, turn. You're not trying to get breaking down your form and then thrust. We go to. The discus, same thing while we're practicing it, practicing. You wanna practice your, getting your grip right, carrying that suitcase. You're just gonna get at your angle, go back, practice on, you're going back, and you're just gonna release at the release point. So, down, go back, release point. And you wanna practice that release point is straight out in front of your face, not over to the side, way over here. Slow it down, get your form right, get the release points right. On your hammer, um, with your lighter hammer or your regulation hammer, this one you wanna practice the one spin. You just want to practice the spin part, not above the head. Just getting used to the release. So you want to go back and then around, release. Just get used to your releasing. Also, you want them to get this one down before they do anything above the head? They, they could practice with the heavy one just to get used to it, but. Mm -hmm. It's good to practice with a lighter one and go back and forth between your heavy one. Again, so down here, you're talking about this point. You're gonna do one turn, release up. Release up high. It gets more distance. That just got more distance because I released it up high. You're gonna do each of those releases for 25 reps of feet for a couple sets. So, you have your javelin drills, your shot put drills, your discus, weighted throw, and hammer drills. If you're not doing it, obviously you can skip it, uh, but those are your drills, and get good at that phase of it. Then we'll add the next phase, and you'll be doing it like a master. That's it for the, uh, this conditioning for the uh, field athletes, like I said, next week, we're gonna add a couple exercise, a couple of training drills to it, and you're gonna do these for two weeks. Uh, have a good one.